Oh. Someone is sharpening something. Oh shit. It's a sniper. This is bad. This is bad. Nice dodge. I'm shot not. I knew Johansson would it's do the servants of Satan. But I said this type was the arch fiend himself. Where is Lacroix? You can't keep the professor here. He had tenure. He is under divine protection. If you want him, come take him if you can. If only the dead told tales, they would not they would all know not to stand in my path. Oh oh oh. Can I hide? Nope, nope, cannot hide for long. I just gotta bum rush him. I can't hide be behind this, I think. It's metal. Look at these werewolves. Compared to the vampires, they're huge! I wonder if I'm gonna meet a werewolf at some point. Come on, shoot me! No, no, don't shoot me! In the face! I mean, try to shoot me! Am I safe down here? Oh, that's a hand grenade, I think. Blood heal. Ow! Come on, bushwhacker! Ow! Where'd he go? The hell? Buck! Where are you? Oh, you're down there, you son of a bitch! How am I supposed to survive if I have to run in these wide open spaces? Come on, Buck! No, don't run away! You son of a bitch! Where is he now? Where is he? Oh, he's up there. Run, 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 run! Stop hitting me! How did you miss? Oh, come on! He's gonna guard camp this thing. Damn it! So it seems he takes a few seconds to. Uh, maybe I should wait for him to reload. Come on, keep shooting. Oh, I'm out of uh, blood. Use and use. He's reloading. He's got me in my his sights. Now where is he? Up there. Come at me. I'm getting closer. Come on. Reload. One more. Come on. Go, 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 go. And chop it, 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 chop idea against this guy. One more. There we go. No! Here, one more! Damn it! Come on, die! Die, 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 die! One more. We only need one more. Now he's up there. Okay, I can deal with that. Maybe I can return the fire with one of these. Boop. Boop. Shoot me. Come on, shoot me. 
Did I hit him? I hit him! I missed him! Come on! Hit him, hit him, hit him, hit him! He's reloading! Oh, he didn't! Oh, he reloaded! Too quickly for me! Damn it! Damn it, visible walls! Shoot me! Take this! One more! What? What do you mean, zero? Aha! I got him! A bit cheesy in the end! But hitting him with the... Uh... Ooh, hello! A new sword, is it? Um, it might be. No, it's a katana. But I want that sniper rifle. Because reasons. We'll drop this one. And pick up this one. Remington M24 SWS. Whew! That was quite hectic. Damn snipers. He's camping a lot. He was camping a lot. But I got to him. I told you everything. There's no reason for you to keep me here. Let me go! Dr. Johansson! Eh, uh, what's up, Doc? I am an archaeologist. You can't hold me here like this. I am a hostage. I do not need protection. Bring me back to my hotel at once. Okay. I will take you on a boat ride if you speak of sarcophagi. Yeah, yeah, okay, anything, just get me out of these caverns and away from these crazies. I think I'm starting to get pneumonia. <coughs> Tell me a story about this Ancoran sarcophagus. The sarcophagus? You went through all that trouble for the sarcophagus? Yeah, I'll tell you. But don't you think it would be better to get out of here before those men come back? Oh, them! I just punched their cards. Places under new management. I guess if you can get all the way here, you deserve the answers. But can I make one request first? After I answer your questions, you will help me escape. Yeah? All right. Where should I begin? Tell me a story about the sarcophagus. Let's start with the history of the Ankaran sarcophagus. That is a long and interesting legend, lost and found throughout the ages. Tell me, are you familiar with the Assyrians? Intimately. I love their work. Uh, yeah, yeah, well, the markings on the sarcophagus seem to hint that it is from some time between 1050 and 800 BC, which was a period of fierce expansion by the Assyrians. Oddly, for those years, only one king shows up on the historical record. This one is listening! While most likely he wiped all evidence of his predecessor's existence or passed the name to his heirs, one monarch, Mesarach, the one-eyed king, is given credit for the territory and achievements of this time. But he would have had to have been over 250 years old, like a Dracula or something. Or something? I find it hard to believe a sarcophagus with a person as important as Maserach could remain in, uh, what is the word, pristine or intact condition for so many years, but this is who is believed to be contained within. Did you look inside? Maybe you have not heard. It was stolen from the museum before we had a chance to open it. Usually, we use equipment to carbon date, x-ray, and take air samples before we pry open the lid. But someone opened it on the uh, Elizabeth Dane. A real vampire, really? You know, it is interesting that you ask me that. The goddess on the outside of the sarcophagus was Lamastu. In Assyrian myth, Lamastu was an evil demoness who preyed on humans. Many people cite her as the mother of vampire myth, and... The engravings on and found around the sarcophagus portray a regal figure drinking the blood of his enemies. 
Now, this image is found in many cultures, specifically among those of royal lineage. But there is a quite scientific explanation. He was the first LARPer? A disorder known as porphyria. In short, it is caused by a deficiency of the iron in the blood, and in many cultures, for the nobility that could conceivably get away with the cure, the treatment was to drink human blood. He knew the sweet ecstasy of... I mean, he drank blood? Perhaps. Drinking the blood of your enemies is, if nothing else, symbolic. It can inspire fear in your foes and dissidents. Don't misunderstand me, I in no way believe it was a vampire. Vampires, that's what caused this whole mess. These maniacs believe they exist. Why did you discover it? Uh, that is, you see, in archaeology, one can spend years looking for a dig site. Following local rumors, studying old maps, it's a complicated process, very boring. This one is listening! Finding and organizing a dig is the least interesting part of an archaeologist's job. Trust me, you don't want to hear about it. Hmm, lying? I don't know what would make you believe that. I have been very forthcoming with you so far. I uh, think that maybe you are not as familiar with the process as me. It called to you. No, it wrote you. What am I... Okay, I tell you. Yeah, I was not even aware of the sarcophagus' existence until I received a package with no reply address in the mail. Inside was the information on how to find it and the key. Please keep it a secret or I could be ruined. The key! I want it! Mesurak is inside with no doubt? That I can't be sure of, nor can anyone. But I promise you it is more likely to be filled with uh, gummy bears than vampires. Perhaps maybe a mummy, but not likely the kind to go about chasing Abbott and Costello. Can you tell me another story of vampires? Not much, really. I'm an archaeologist, not a mythologist. But I do know that Lamastu, the Assyrian demoness, was thought to have been the inspiration for Lilith, the first wife of Adam in the Jewish Old Testament, another source of the vampire myth. No more stories. I want in. Ah, quite interesting. There is a surprisingly complex mechanical lock on the face of the sarcophagus. By sheer luck, we were able to find the key not far from the sarcophagus. Why no one ever found it and robbed it? It's perplexing. The small box that we heard about on the Elizabeth Dane or whatever it was. Or the museum, maybe it was. I want it and I can't wait for Christmas. How strange you would ask. I haven't seen the key since it was loaded onto the Elizabeth Day yeah. in Turkey. It was in the logbook. It book. was stolen before the sarcophagus even. I am still hopeful that the police find both pieces before the contents can be disturbed. Where is the spare? No, it's not the kind of key you can copy at the hardware store. It's actually very sophisticated. And I meant to study it at the museum. I've answered all your questions. Do you think now you could please get me out of here? I don't care who you are or why you've had so many questions about the sarcophagus. I just want to leave this place. Oh, this might be really tough if I have to escort him out. Because I kinda snuck by everyone. They're all alive, but let's go on a cruise together, just you and me. Thank you, my friend. I don't know where you came from, but I will never forget this kindness. Don't mention it. Uh, don't mention it, or better, do. Humanity gained. Now, this is going to be hard. Oh shit, oh shit. He's alive. Judgment is here. 
Johansson! Oh, I have one minute! How is Johansson gonna make it? If everyone out here is alive, I'm in deep shit. Come on, Johansson! Um, come on, Johansson! Wait, where did he go? Johansson? Isn't he gonna follow me out? Well, I'm getting out of here. Hopefully he uh, teleported out or something. I only have 30 seconds. Oh, there was a uh, boat docked over here. They were guarding it. Come on, 25 seconds. Run like the wind. There it is. 15 seconds. Ah, uh, 10 seconds. I think we're gonna make it. I hope we're gonna make it. Come on, come on, get out. Whew, we made it. But what about Johansson? What happened to Johansson? What the hell? What the hell's this? What the hell's going on here? I'm very curious about that, but I want to go back to my haven first. Because I think this is the one, the critical moment where I have to talk to Heather for the uh, body armor that I've been given a tip about. So let's head on over there. And I probably have at least one more email from that mysterious friend. Let's check it out. Heather, my sweet. Is everything okay? Can I put some... Oh, I haven't read this at all. Uh, okay, nothing good. No, they don't want to drop it. I want to put it in here. Give. 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 I need more research skill. Gotta keep that in mind. And I'll give this to... There we go. Heather! I had a dream this afternoon, as I lay napping near where you sleep. I was running behind you in the moonlight. When I tripped and fell, I looked up and you were gone. And then I noticed what I tripped on. My corpse. As long as you can see this face, you are safe and loved. <sighs> You're so kind to me. I can be nothing but, my love. Although, this is a platonic love, you know. Master? Bleed for me! Might wanna replenish my stock before we check our email and then head to the prince. Om nom nom nom! Come on, email! Two unread! The White Bishop Falls. Is that supposed to be Bach? Uh, Vivi, it felt so liberating to open up to you in that last email, so I dipped my pen in my soul again to write another for you. Father, I never knew you. Mother, I ran away from you. Sire, you forgot me, but lover, you are forever in my heart. Think my looks will stop me from being taken seriously as a poet? No, of course not, Vivi. Of course not. But that was um, not not very interesting, Vivi. Can you like get better at that? Sorry. Now let's head over to the prince and see what the hell's going on there. There was a cop car there, and there was a lot of debris. So there's probably been uh, some sort of attack. Before we head in, I raised my uh, intelligence in order to get more research so we can use this. Uh, Race is your dodge talent. I'll take it. Thank you. How's my dodge? It's maxed out. Amazing. Now, LaCroix, what the hell's going on in here? Oh no. Oh, these are just generic guards. Where's my friend? The tubby. 
that I forget the name of. What the hell? Oh, it's a SWAT guy. I thought he uh, was charred to uh, burn. Charred to death, whatever it's called. But LaCroix is probably alright. He has his sheriff at his side. No doubt. Doesn't look like the battle reached up here. Beckett! You can always count on the Sabbat to do the wrong thing for the right reasons. They're reckless, but they don't normally try to attract this much attention. This carelessness warrants observation. I hope it doesn't become pandemic. The Sabbat did this? I'll be back in a minute. I gotta talk to the prince. <laughs> With whom do they think they're dealing? Attack me in my own building! They're desperate. <laughs> They've shown their weakness. A last-ditch attempt to steal the prize. There are black handprints all over. The Sabbat. A pack of shovelheads with cheap pistols was all they could muster. Two got a few stories up, but I took care of them. And my sheriff brought the rest their final death in the lobby. Sabbat animals. So long, Sabbat. Now we can focus on our greatest nemesis, the sun. No matter how many times you think you've wiped them out, they always come back. This time their target is the Ankaran sarcophagus. They will not stop until they've feasted on the ancient they believe to be inside. Diablerists. Why would they want to eat it? Diablery, this word is mysterious to me. The Sabbat's infamy is in no small part due to their practice of Diablery. That is, drinking the blood of other kindred. Especially older ones. Until they are dead. Diablerists gain the power of those they've fed upon. And the Camarilla. This is an act punishable by death. For the moment, we've manipulated the press into reporting tonight's events as a terrorist attack. Their soldiers may be no danger to me, but their threat to the masquerade is abundant. As my best agent, I'm sure you can guess my course of action. Counterattack! They bullied me when I was weak, but now I return to the playground a black belt. The Sabbat have made their haven at the Hallibrook Hotel. Right under our noses, here in downtown. Kill their leader. The rest will scamper out of the city. This is the last time they ever set foot in Los Angeles. Before you go, Beckett told me you went to the Society of Leopold. Did you find out how my sarcophagus is opened? There's a key! I only answer questions for prizes. Take your money. Tell me. What have you learned? Don't get snappy with me! The vanishing crate from the Dane, inside the key to that old box. A key? Where? Do you have it? I do not have any keys, but I opened the door to the next world for Bach. <laughs> not only did you infiltrate the Society of Leopold, but you managed to kill their greatest hunter. You certainly are developing a legend for yourself. Superb. A toast to you, and to victory over the Sabbat, and to Bach. May all his progeny meet such fates. If hunters need their blood, they should keep it away from me. Sabbat too. The Sabbat must be wiped out before dawn. Then, when you come back, we'll begin the hunt for the key. Right, sir. Beckett, now I've talked to the prince. Do you, you have anything new? count on the Sabbat. Um... Words, words, words. My hands have already sought to destroy them. Well, perhaps for this pack, it's for the best. I digested Johansson's brain. What did Johansson have to say? Maserak, a Syrian overlord, is within. He think he might be, I think he might be dead. A Syrian origin. Glad to see I'm not losing my touch. As for Maserak, I'll have to research that name. See what I can find. You do that. Let us see. I wonder... Nah. The question is, how does one open the box? The answer is a key. What do I win? The lock. And key. An invention as ancient as greed. I should have guessed. 
All we have to do is find a victor in this nonsense. They'll be the one with the key. Llama Stew! The recipe's on the box! Llama Stew? She was a Lilith figure. They represent empowered women and the threat of such women to male-dominated society. Strange she would be engraved on a king's tomb. I have given you the guts. Can you find the heart? It seems to corroborate my own evidence. I'm going to have to study it a little more. Maybe dig up some information on Meserak and the Lamastu myth. I'm certain the key will show up in time. Your information is appreciated. Great success! Now I purge the Sabbat's blood from the gore of the city.